Hello boys, <laughs> how are you, alright? Do you want to jump in the back for a lift? This is cool, isn't it? So you finished school early? Yeah. Wow, what did the teachers say about that? Say fine? Uh, I guess so, I guess this is Harry's <laughs> really. Okay, so you've got a few questions for me lads, have you? Yeah. Cool, go on then, fire away. Do you still see Gareth Bale and did you ever have a fight with him in school? <laughs> I didn't have a fight with him in school. Um, Wales football actually trained with the Blues train, so the other day I was training with the, with the Blues boys and he walked past, so I had a, had a quick conversation. So, um, yeah, we sort of, they stay in the same hotel as um, the Welsh rugby team as well, so sometimes you cross past every now and then. What was the worst and best lesson in school? <laughs> Um, the worst lesson for me would have been um, probably drama. I used to get embarrassed having to do acting and stuff, so I didn't really like to do that acting and drama. And the best lessons, I obviously like PE because obviously that was the sports stuff. Um, but I actually quite like science as well. What's your bench press in the gym? <laughs> My best ever bench press is uh, 155. So. What do you bench press? Um, well, I'm... <laughs> yeah, really? oh, you'll get it. So what have you done today then, boys? What's your day look like? What lessons have you had? Oh, drama. Do you like drama? I just said I didn't like drama. Yeah, I was just getting embarrassed, that's all. Yes. I wasn't very good at it. Just like you got it, you know, doing it. Yeah. Have you, boys, uh, have you got girlfriends? Uh, no. No. Oh, what happened? She um, broke up. I wasn't talking to her now. Oh no. Oh, so you're not going out anymore? No. Oh, never. Oh, never mind. Sorry, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Is your house the one of the two really nice houses? Yeah, I got the two landlords in my car, so they're my house, yeah, so that's my house, yeah. Yo, if, if my dad gets a boat, will you come on a fishing trip with him? <laughs> I went and Beck ever been in touch with you regarding a place in I'm a celebrity to get married. <laughs> no, they haven't, but I have done a TV show with Anton Deck once before, called Red, Red or Black. I couldn't go on the jungle because I don't like spiders, so I couldn't go on that one. If you were not Sam which would be the name would you be? Oh, I'd probably say George North, because he's massive and he's fast, and he's got a good six pack as well. <laughs> so I'd say George North. He's not very good looking though, that's what you think. It's a size one. Let's go get Will then, boys, shall we? How do you know Will then? We play rugby together. Yeah, we yeah. play rugby together. For Rabina? Yeah, Rabina. Yeah. Hello, boys. Hello. Hey, Will. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> right then. This is a question from my dad, really. From your dad? Yeah. If you could be in any band, what would what would it be and what would you play? Any band? Yeah. Is that like what instrument would I play? Yeah. I probably play the drums. I used to play the drums a little bit. Um, and if I had to pick a band, there was a band called System of a Down who were pretty oh, cool. Do you like them? Yeah. Do you really? I like, I like Chop Suey. Oh my goodness. Chop Suey. Really I, like I, really I love Chop Suey. I really know System of a Down. Yeah, no, I, like, I quite like System of a Down. I, uh, it's quite good music to train to. So yeah. there we go. Oh, good, uh, good taste in music then. What do you want to be when you grow up? <laughs> Ooh. I'd like to be retired and live on a golf course and want my dog after work be, but I think I have to work. Um, if I, if, if I uh, could do anything, I wanted to be the whole world. I love dogs, so I'd do something which I could, uh, I could work with dogs. If you saw Alan Molan walking down the street, would you ankle tap him to the trip though? <laughs> I've had a chat with Alan a few times actually since he sent me off, so um, he's actually a really nice guy. Have you ever used the fact that you're a twin for any advantage? <laughs> uh, no, my brother has. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, one time I was out and somebody was really drunk and thought they saw me, so I pretended I was my twin brother Ben, but they were really drunk. I wouldn't normally do that, so, um, but yeah, I've only used that once to get out of a sticky situation, but yeah, not too often. Ben, ben pretends he's been like... Do you talk to your dog? And if so, what do you say? I always talk to my dog, my best mate. Oh, me and Lenny talk about everything, you know? So I'll talk to Lenny about... Hot Hotspur, uh, talk to him about rugby, family, talk to him about my little one, which is his sister, so I got a little daughter called Anna, so that's his little sister. Yeah, no, me and Lenny, we go on long walks and uh, yeah, we chat to each other a lot, so he's good, he listens well. Have you ever seen Joshua Lee's hair and scrape out before the trash? 
<laughs> Nobody. He gets the Mickey taken out of his hair. I think his hair is pretty cool. I yeah, like his I hair. He never shaved it off. It's taken him quite a long time to grow that. So, uh, but yeah, no, I'll, I'll tell when I next see Josh, I'll tell him you think his, uh, his hair looks like a bowl of tarantulas, and I'll let you know what he says. It's great that you take all your old kit down to the charity shop because I've picked up your greenie cake. Have you? Yeah. Oh, is that there? Yeah. Look at that, it's a Cardiff Blues one as well, look. There we go. I thought I recognised that. I thought you just bought it for the club shop or something. Oh, that's yeah. awesome. Look what I found in it. Oh, no. That was yours. <laughs> Yeah, no, I always wear Superman pants. <laughs> nice pants. They've got me there. <laughs> oh, stitched stuff by 10 year old. <laughs> Bet you were cheeky when you were young. What have you gone away with? Oh, I was telling the boys earlier that because I'm a twin, me and Ben used to play a couple of twin pranks on a couple of teachers, you know, so we swap classes and stuff. And then when we go away with rugby, you do like. You know, silly rugby pranks like covering the toilet with cling film. But yeah. you, you've got to do it really smooth and take your time on it and make sure it looks really good. So then when you go for a wee, it all bounces back off. So you can give that a go with mum and dad's toilet later. Let, let me know how it goes. How does it feel to captain the lions? Um, yeah, that no, was good. I, I had fun with it. I'm not so bothered about being captain. Just, uh, I love playing for the lions, you know? Yeah. I always wanted to play for the lions when I was a kid. So, yeah. Yeah. You boys watch that? Yeah, yeah, yeah watch I watched everyone. Did you reckon? It was good. Yeah, we should have won. Yeah, we should have. Yeah. Come close, but New Zealand are pretty good, so we did yeah. okay. We did alright. Did you think it's the best player on the Blues? Uh, <laughs> I think um, our back row is really good, so I think Ellis Jenkins and Josh Levine have been good yeah. for a long time. Um, is Ellis? is injured now as yeah. well, yeah. I think Ray Lilo has been great for us the last few years. He's been really good. Um, so yeah, those boys have probably played consistently the best, you know, over the last few seasons. I think they play a lot of games and, and they always play really well. So yeah, Alice Jenkins, Josh Levine and Ray Lilo have been some of our most consistent performers, I think. Yeah. 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 <laughs> right then, nice. Alright, should we jump out and have a photo together? Yeah. There we go. It's just been like, yeah, it's been.